Hi, this is Ahmed with you from Mudir. If you find this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe. In this video, we're going to learn how to use multiple currencies. Sometimes the business is using multiple currencies because they are operating in different countries. The first step on that is to set the base currency. We've done that before in video 4 and video 5, we've defined the foreign currencies. You can get back to them. After this step, you can use these currencies, the base and the foreign currencies, for different transactions, such as bank and cash accounts, the expense claims, customers, suppliers, employees, special accounts, and journal entries. So here, we are dealing with Bahraini dinars as a base currency. If you want to know if we've got foreign currencies or not, just scroll down, go to settings, then click on currencies. Now we've got the base currency, which is Bahraini dinar, and we've got the foreign currencies here, which is Swiss franc. In our case, we've got some customers who are paying in Swiss francs. If you wish to check all the transactions which are in Swiss francs, click on bank and cash accounts. Now we can see that most of the transactions are in Bahraini dinars, except for this transactions which is in Swiss francs. So by clicking the Swiss francs amount here, you can see that these transactions are in Swiss francs. If you go back, you can see that in cash and bank accounts main menu, there is two kinds of currencies here in total. The total in Bahrain dinars and the total in Swiss francs. You can also edit these transactions according to your needs. And that's how we can use multiple currencies in Manager. If you find this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe. And before we are saying goodbye, we are pleased to announce that we are now officially the resellers of Manager Cloud. You can have a free trail of Manager Cloud through the link in the description below. This is Ahmed with you from Mudir. Thanks for tuning in. Have a nice and productive day.